Hey everybody, how's life treating you? I'm Russ Robo and welcome back to Supermarket Simulator. Last we left off, there were a few updates that actually came about the game. Um, supposedly the graphics have improved, which I can kind of see that. It's looking really nice. Um, I don't know about the town, the vehicles and all that good stuff. I haven't really explored it yet because obviously uh, I've been trying to... <laughs> I've been working a nine day straight shift, so... Before I get lost, uh, let's get back to our store. I was going to try to fix my so ah! <laughs> uh, I was going to try to fix the uh, Rust Smart sign, but I'm scared to spend money on that just yet. First, I want to hire my first cashier, get some more products in going, and I'll be the stalker and they can be the cashier. Uh, I just don't want to go bankrupt because I had to take out that $2,000 loan in order to even be able to. Uh, pay off my other loans so I'm going from loan to loan which obviously is not good you do not want to do that uh, let's see we just got your cashier complete checkouts yeah okay store level 10 I think that was the last thing I was trying to do was complete the store level 10 yes so we've got our cashier now we can open and spend all of the rest of our money on product which I should have done before I opened the store don't worry uh, whatever your name is, the customers will come in soon, and oh my god, I'm going broke. But it's okay, because I'm going to put all this on the shelf. Oh right, the maximum number of things I can buy. What do I got left? A thousand bucks, okay. Now all we got to do is focus on selling our product and paying off our debts. I gotta hurry. Do good cashiering. I haven't even met the guy. Ah. Uh, I'm so far behind most of the regular Let's Players that are actually doing this as a regular series. All of this stuff is in the wrong spot. Uh, uh, but I'm, I'm still ahead of Mark. I'm still ahead. Oh, God, they're running over my product. But, yeah, it's been stressful trying to keep up with the... Um, I just finished a 10-hour shift. Um, I'm working nine days straight this week, and technically it's only an eight-hour shift, but they give you an hour for lunch, and I'm, stick I'm still stuck there for an hour. So I finished a nine-hour shift then. We got cereal, too. Oh, I think I accidentally put one of those on the bottom. How's our cashier doing? I haven't even met the poor guy. Uh, what's your name? What's your name? Now I'm going to call him Ezekiel. His name's Ezekiel. Do good job, Ezekiel. I'm proud of you. We're going to make this store great. It's going to be Russ Smart. Russ and Ezekiel. Couldn't find sliced bread. Oh, God. That, I know that's one of the things I bought. Ah, I got to sneeze. Don't sneeze. Display is full. Yes, buy all the milk. Thank you so much. You're the best. You're the best customer ever. I don't even know what's next. A stalker or storage? Oh, man. And I should have charged my mouse. Please, don't go away. We've got all the products you need today. <laughs> ah, it's out there on the street. I should have, I should have, I should have stocked all of this before opening the store. <laughs> Please, don't make me beg. Get over here and buy these egg. <laughs> Promise no more rhyming. Okay, that's it for the rhyming. I've already lost probably dozens of subscribers off of just that. God, I'm just so glad I don't have to cashier anymore. No, where'd that box go? Did I kick it? I... Dang, I should have put the bread out first because somebody was like, can't find sliced bread. You can only order, I guess, 10 things at a time. So we've actually got a lot more stuff to put up because now I need to order 10 more things. So ordering like shit. On hand is going to be my new thing. Eh, we're kind of low. Are we getting low on money yet? No, no, we're still doing good. Because we're making money as we're continuously selling stuff. I was hoping that would actually be a thing. Now we're actually starting to make progress where we're making more money than we're losing. And I'm going to pay off our debts one at a time. 
but I need to have a cutoff limit. I need to make sure I don't go below a certain amount. So let's say, what time is it? Three o'clock. Uh, we don't need to turn on the lights yet. You are doing an amazing job, Ezekiel. Thank you so much. Um, we need to make sure we don't go below 500, maybe? Uh, 200. No, let's make that 200. What was I going to do? Oh, yeah, pay off our debts. Uh, the debt, actually, like, it'll get you. I paid off all my debts before. See, I did that $2,000 loan to pay off the $750 loan. That one is paid off, but now I have this $200, $2,000 loan that I need to pay off. Payments. All installments. Yes, I paid it. That was right. That was the first thing I did. That was the first thing I did. Let me double check that. Oh, I took the $2,000 loan to pay off the $750 loan. And then I saved a little bit of it to pay off the $2,000 loan. I don't remember paying off the $2,000 loan. <laughs> pay off. Pay off early. Wait. Pay. Remaining amount. Remaining payment, $2,600. Yeah, that's what I'm going to owe them. Number of payments left, 15 days. Pay off early. You can only pay it off early if you have that total amount. I do not yet have that total amount. All installments are paid. Loans taken, one. Payments remaining, 15. Late payment fee. The late payment fee will get you. That's what almost got me on that $750 payment. So it's just not due yet. I knew I didn't pay it yet. I'm like, did I blow somebody? <laughs> What's going on here? What do you mean all my debts are paid? Oh, Jesus. I'm running out of product over here. Oh, jeez. <laughs> okay, okay, get serious. Order, order, order. Just one of everything. I don't even know if this is the good way to do this. This is a bad way to do this. All I want to do is focus on in stock. Keeping shelves stocked. We are below my maximum. Uh, did I say 250? I said 250. Why are we going down? Oh, that's the total amount. Right. Whatever. Dang it, I got confused. I got, I got the number we were paying for the product confused with the amount we already had. But it doesn't matter because it's only we are only going to be open for another hour, and we just need to shell, shell, shell all these sell, sell, sells. <laughs> God, I'm, I am maxed out right now. I am, I am maxed out. You don't even, you don't even understand. I can't even look at the camera when I'm saying that. You don't even understand. It's like, I understand that, you know, Markiplier's content is the greatest thing ever. And that he, he, you know, he probably is frantic and panicked while he's doing it. But I'm actually frantic and panicked because, <laughs> let me tell you about my day. Uh, it actually wasn't that bad. Uh, we unloaded a 2100 piece truck. Uh, we had, I don't know how many pallets were on the first one. It, I actually, I can do the math. It was 21 pallets total. I helped unload the pallet with eight, or with 14. I, oh God, I can't even think. The first truck, the second truck had six, 14 pallets. Yes. So that leaves. Seven. Seven left, correct? Seven left, seven pallets. So the first truck had seven pallets. The second truck had 14. I helped unload the second truck. Um, that wasn't so bad. God, they're still not finding stuff. They're still not finding stuff. I've still got a lot of money. I just need to cheat. I need a cheat sheet to see what I need. Ah, uh, Ezekiel, you did amazing. Uh, before we close off the store, though, let me close off the store, but before we end off the day... Actually, do I? How do I dismiss him? Also, I need to pay him. Management definitely don't want to fire them. Licenses, bills. There we go. It's under bills, not loans. Bill, one, due date. Pay, 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 pay. Yes. Hiring, storage, locked, 800. Let's purchase that when we get... I'm just so scared. I'm so... I'm deadly afraid of going bankrupt because it has happened. 
Okay, coffee next to the tea. God, I haven't even been checking the prices. Uh, let's go on ahead and open up, because I'll be busy the entire time. No, guaranteed. Guaranteed I will be busy the entire time. It will keep me busy. And then we'll just use extra shelf space for extra product. I don't know what's more important. What do you guys... Well, you can't tell me, because by the time you see this, it'll be tomorrow. Hopefully tomorrow. Um... I don't know what's more important, storage or the third license. With another license, I can sell more product. But I also have to focus on my shelf space. I'm probably going to go bankrupt, but we're just going to go as far as we possibly can. Okay, now, I got an idea. I need to keep an eye on the customers, and whatever they say they couldn't find, that's what I need to order. That is my, Sir, that is my job. Shopping for at Russ Mart, don't forget to... Jesus, breathe, Russell. Don't forget to breathe. Uh, uh, buy a coupon. Have a coupon. Do we have coupons? I don't even know. What are we getting low on? Cheese, uh, water, milk, coffee, eggs. Uh. It's up to me to buy as many products as I can sell. Let's see, this is... Ooh, are, now, down means I pay less for it, correct? See how it's down? The price is down, right? I want to buy stuff that's down. I mean, that is really cheap. Yeah, if it's down... If it's less than a dollar, I'm buying it. Like, look at this. Some stuff... Now, that's very expensive. Cereal must have gone up. If it's less than a dollar, I'm buying it. Purchase... Because we got to be getting low. Look at us, level 11. I'm telling you, man, the cashier, that's where it's at. That's that's where it's at. Like, the stalker is probably just as useful if you're okay with, like, cashiering and ringing customers up constantly. I feel like I've done enough of it. I feel like I've done enough of it. It just depends on where you want to go. You can probably go either route, and I'm just going to put this straight through your body. Is that okay, sir? Well, you don't get a say. How about that? We are, we are almost out of cereal, so I'm going to go ahead and order that real quick. You don't get a say in the matter, sir. I'm going to stock whether you like it or not. Uh, God, it's so pricey. It's so pricey. Look at that, $52. I want to wait for that to come down. Let the last one sell. <laughs> I don't know, man. I mean, uh, see, now I'm thinking, oh, God, that's the last one. All right, I'm coming up on the price of the cereal. Cereal's going to go up. I'm sorry, folks. See, 104 for a case. AK? No, y'all, y'all ain't getting cereal today. Mm -mm, no, 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 no cereal. Sad, sad shame. Sad shame. You ain't 104 dollars for kit for a case of cereal. For 12, that's 12 boxes. 100. Oh God, I just, I need to put this. No, I got it. I got it. I got it. We'll get the storage. We're getting the storage real quick. We're going to get it. We're going to get it. It's going to be okay. Everything's going to be okay for us. Life is stressful. It really is. It really is. But it's going to be okay. I'm going to turn this into the Bob Ross series, you know? Bob Russ. We're going with Bob Russ in this one. You know? Sometimes you work in retail and customers aren't always really nice, but that's okay. We're just going to put this milk here. We realize that, you know, we don't want to take up all the shelf space with milk, but hey, if you tell anybody, what? There's customers that are talking about they can't find certain products, even though I'm stocking them all as fast as I possibly can. But you know what? We're not going to hurt this lady. We're not going to hurt her. It's going to be okay. Thought about it, but we're not going to do that today. We're not going to do that because we're just trying to get by. Our shop's going up nice. Everything's getting ordered. We're making a lot of money. Don't have to take anybody out today. Maybe tomorrow. Maybe the next day. Hopefully not ever. But you know, some days you just gotta you just gotta try to roll with the punches. That's not bad for the whole thing. I mean, especially if I sell it all. I, I still haven't been able to. Uh, I will turn the lights on for you, sir. Ezekiel, thank you so much. I hope I'm the only person that names him Ezekiel. 
And by the way, the the only reason I did that is because like I didn't know his name, and I went, "What's your name?" And then I thought, "What's your name?" You know, like the meme, the Ezekiel meme. You Ezekiel, what's your name? <laughs> uh, I'd put, I would actually put that up in the video, but that video is copyrighted. I, I can't. So you'll have to, you'll you'll have to look it up. Uh, don't take my word. Just stop not finding things. I'm stalking as fast as I can. It's like Walmart all over again. Uh, that's why this is my most popular series. Because it's like getting up. I didn't order three cases of cereal. Did I? How much cereal is there? Please tell me it's not all cereal. Anyway, that's why people like watching me play this, because it's like watching Markiplier play Getting Over It with Bennett Foddy. They love to see YouTubers suffer. And I specifically told myself when I started this channel that I wasn't going to play any of those type of games. Now it's, um, what is it? Something Together? Chained Together. Everybody's doing Chained Together now. I watched Needs Gaming play it. It was fun. Uh, I watched about half the video. Oh. Oh, I've still got some. Can I put that one in there? I know I can. I just can't remember how I'm supposed to do it. No, I can put stuff back in a case. I can't... Yeah, it either goes in a case or on the shelf. I can't. Dang. Gotta get that storage. Gonna get that storage. I just... I'm so scared of going broke. I'm so... I'm, I'm terrified. But man, with all these customers, this fast? I can't even keep stuff on the shelves. Look at it! Look! Did you see that? That was like some stuff the Matrix! <laughs> I, 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 ah, I'd reenact it, but I don't want to take my hands off the keyboard because, God, that line is getting long. Ezekiel, I'm going to get you some help. Don't you worry, I'll get you some help. But storage comes first, because holy crap, we are selling out fast, my dude. Why don't we have a baler inside the store? Why do I have to run outside to take the trash out? See, we need a baler. We need we need a baler. We need a baler. Let's get a baler. Can we get a baler? By the way, for those of you not in retail, balers are what is used to break down cardboard boxes. Um, I can't pay off our loan just yet. None of our other products is out there. Do you actually go home? Do you have a family? Are they okay? You can talk to me, buddy. It's all right. I know that look. I know that look. I've, I've seen that look. That's the dead look. You've resigned yourself. Let me just, a moment of silence for this man. I've been there. I've been there. 11 years in retail, I've been there. That's the look. He knows. He knows he's going to be here for another 40 years, and then we retire. <laughs> we do this for 40 years, and then we die. <laughs> Thank you, Squidward. All right, let's end off the day, and then storage? Storage first. I want to see what it looks like. I'm being irresponsible, because I don't have enough money to pay off all, all of our debts. I mean, it says all installments are paid, but that's just the installments. Storage. I need storage. Thank you. Oh my god, I gotta see it. I gotta see it before I start the next day. This way I can actually look at it. Don't you dare tell me that is locked. It better not be. I thought that was storage. Is it the one outside? It is. Can I go in? <laughs> okay, so I've got a story about this. Another YouTuber, I haven't watched him yet, but obviously because I make these videos, they're recommended to me. He made a thumbnail that made it look like an Amazon warehouse. He's like, biggest storage ever! If I could find the thumbnail, I'll put it up in the little, maybe over here. But he made it look like an Amazon warehouse. And I thought that's what, because I saw that thumbnail, I thought that's what the storage actually was going to be. And I guarantee you, he made that thumbnail to make fun of the fact that storage is this. 
But to be fair, if you think about it, that for this game, that's really all you need. It's, it really is. But God, no pallet jacks. No. This bitch ain't even got no light. Oh, pardon my language. It ain't even got no light. Well, I have to buy a light. I gotta buy a light to put in here. I just re I gotta buy. You couldn't even provide me with a light bulb. The audacity, the the sheer, the sheer rudeness. And I guess we're just gonna leave the door open. Come here, come on, come on, get your free shit. Anyway, let's end off the day. Twelve minutes. I'm assuming the other one was like ten or fifteen minutes. We'll end this off in just a second. But first, I want to give the audience some oil. Oh yeah, did you see when Markiplier wound up with that? I called it the the oil blisk, the oil obelisk. He bought this gigantic, ridiculous-looking display that had all four corners, and he put nothing but oil on it. I love it. I, I just I love that kind of stuff. What am I doing? I just bought storage. But I hate there's this one thing. Why can't I put that thing into this thing? I want I want a full case. That's what that's what's bothering me. I want a full case. They always they always taught me on they, they trained me on, you know, no partial casings. So now we have a full case. We'll put this full case in storage, which is where it should go, and I'm going to assume that even though the door is wide open, no one's going to steal our oil. <laughs> Thank you for shopping at Rustmart, sir. You have a lovely day. Grab this case, put the extra remaining oil on there, and then throw away. But. But now it's not full. I guess we're, we got a partial case in. What about... Well, Walmart had a different way. They... I don't know. They had to have had partial... No, they, they wouldn't have partial cases. They just had a partial... Partial inventory. I don't know. Their way is inventory is key. In stock is key. It's the number one thing. To hell with being nice to the customers. You keep that shit in stock. If they want to buy it, it better be on the shelf. And if it's not, that's your ass. I ain't lying. I don't work for them anymore, so I can say whatever the hell I want to. Uh, we need sugar. And, uh, okay, sugar. I'm assuming cheese. Eggs, milk, because all that just gets bought up real quick. A little bit at a time, Russ. A little bit at a time. Don't overdo it. We're down to 200 God, we're down to $200. I went over my limit. I said my limit was 250 And I surpassed my limit. I'm under $250. Um, I can't tell Ezekiel to do anything about it. He's doing his damnedest. He's, he's giving it all he's got, as they say. Over like the movie Jaws. I'm giving her all she's got, Cotton. What could he not find? I've I've got everything. Pick it up off the street for God's sakes. Help a man out. Help. A oh, don't tell me. Come on, don't don't be like that. I frick it. The milk's there now. I haven't been checking prices on anything. I could I could be practically giving this shit away. Who knows? It's a mystery. <laughs> God help me. Like I can't, it's going it goes too fast. It goes too fast. I can't check prices. Okay. I can check the prices. Um while I'm stocking the freight. Like a normal person. Stop. Uh and that customer just tripped on it. Trip hazard. Uh, ah, see? I should have checked. I'm only making like not even a dollar on this. No, five dollars. No! You oh, I'm probably I mean, I'm not... Oh, God, I could I could lose money on stuff. I don't think I am. Okay. I got, oh, that's... Of course... Well, hmm. Why am I doing... Ezekiel, thank you so much. You're a wonderful person. You know, ever since you showed up, nobody gets stuck in the, in, in the shelves anymore. They're not getting stuck. I don't know if that's an update or if that's you, but it, it just must be because they love you so darn much. They just can't wait to check out. You're freaking awesome. I'm not gonna. I'm not. I'm not gonna abuse you like retail has abused me. 
I'm going to be nice to you. Because if you ever decide to go rogue, there's only one there's only one person you're going to be looking at, and that's this guy. And we can't have that. <laughs> we can't have it. It ain't it ain't going down like that, see? <laughs> oh, we're making so much money. So much money and we're not even using storage. Did I not turn the lights on for you? I am so sorry. You're over here working in the dark and you're still knocking it out. Look at you. Look at you go, my guy. Look at you go. Knocking it out. I'm just putting all this stuff willy-nilly. Sorry, ma'am. Streetwalker. I'm just putting this stuff wherever. <laughs> Why is there so much cereal? Why? I didn't buy that much cereal. I didn't. I swear to God, I didn't. Why did you send me all that cereal? I don't need that much cereal. I already had oil in storage. Now there's more oil. <laughs> I'm bad at this. Uh, 12 years of retail and I'm bad at this. I'm letting people run over my product. Leaving cheese out in the heat. Yes, sir, please. T take it right off my box, why don't you? Uh out of the box off my box that didn't make any sense one thing of cheese go get it now oh god they're stuck in the shelves Ezekiel can you get them out please thank you actually no you're busy uh, can I help you with anything uh, do you need any product today are you looking for milk it's right there oh they're looking for water I bet I'm going to pretend that they're looking for water uh, uh, which one's water crap not that one frick couldn't see it until I opened it, which I probably could have if I knew what I was doing. I could have put it back down. No, that's coffee. G, down. Are, are you water? G, no, you're eggs. You're water. Ma'am, sir, ma'am, sir, sir, ma'am, we've got water. I know that's what you're looking for. Oh my god, I was right. I was right. I'm amazing. I'm the fucking best at this. I'm the best. I ran into the door. Ah. <laughs> They actually were looking for water. That's awesome. Is that why they get sh stuck in the shelves? They decide that there's something that they want, and when they can't find it, they just, you know, like the NPCs keep trying to load it in or something? I don't know. It's like they see the tag. They see the tag, and they're like, I know water's supposed to be there, but it's not, and I want it, and I won't sit. Look here. I likes you, and I won't you. Now we can do this the easy way. Or the hard way. The choice is yours. Are we at nine yet? Oh, thank God. I just barely got it stocked. And I still couldn't even get it stocked in time. Could you imagine if I didn't have Ezekiel? God. I mean, I remember what that was like. <laughs> we were going broke. I don't want to talk about it. Uh, we do have a lot of bills to pay, though. God, that's all we're ending off the day with. Uh, focus. Do I have everything? Flour, water, eggs, I don't know. Sure got a lot of cereal. Let's keep going. Basically, I wanted to... Each of these episodes, I'm going to try to make them only like 30 minutes long. But the main objective is to accomplish one new thing. Technically speaking, I accomplished two new things in this episode. I got Ezekiel and I got storage. So I should probably end it off here. Because uh, I need new content in each episode. Like, I don't need it, but I'd like to have that. I'd like to give that to the audience. Because I don't want y'all to show up just to watch Ezekiel ring stuff up, or me ring stuff up, or me constantly buying stuff over here, and then stocking it over here. You know, if you're going to watch that, I want you to see, you know, a new cashier, or storage, which you've seen that. So, you know, I, I earned that. Next time, like, goals. Goals oriented. So, next episode. What's our goal? What are we doing? We want a milestone. Every episode, Russell, reach a milestone. What's our next milestone? Uh, section 2? God dang, that's expensive. Section 3, section 4, say, God. Why are, they, why are they so expensive? Why did they get more expensive? Dude, I want to see section 15. If they're getting more expensive... Wait a minute. I'm getting gypped. Look at this. Each one is more expensive than the last. Correct? Yes. But look at here. Expand by 4x4. Four four. 
increased pi increased price, same expansion. I'm not happy about that. Why am I paying more for the same amount of space? Same amount of space. Same, same, same. Look at this last one. That is How many fucking zeros is that? Is that 200 Is that $250,000? It can't be. 165,000. Not My I'm stupid. I'm really stupid. No? Let's 800, 1200, 1800, 36, 44, 52, 61,000, 77,000, 89,000. Yeah, it does go into the hundred thousands. That is a hundred, two hundred and fifty thousand dollars. I swear to God, if I pay two hundred and fifty thousand dollars for anything in this game with even virtual currency, my store better be the size of an entire city block. As a matter of fact, you see this white building where my store is? You see this area where storage is? I want that entire building. I want the whole thing. As a matter of fact, I'm taking this one too. I want the whole damn thing. You're charging me that much money? Hell no. You see that hotel? No, that's not a hotel. That shit is Russ Mart. That is mine. If I'm paying $250,000 for anything, I'm getting this whole block. $250,000. Four by four, my butt. You ain't gonna charge me for that. I'm gonna get everything. I'm gonna take the whole street. You don't even know. You don't know this guy. I'm taking all of it. I'm taking... You see that stop sign down there? I'm getting that too. Ma Excuse me. I was standing there. You didn't see me? Anyway, that's all the time I have left for this episode. I hope you all enjoy it. Uh, next thing is going to be, I'm going to try for a stalker. Because if I order it, and they stock it, and Ezekiel rings it up, we are just going to be... Because, I mean, a real store, I'm trying to think realistically. What do you got to have? Uh, like, I'm supposed to be management. I'm the... I'm, I'm management. I ain't supposed to be doing this shit. So... Next thing is going to be, how much does the stock cost? Better get paid. <laughs> Better not be getting as paid as much as me. <laughs> Shit. I know what a stock costs. I know what I make. And it ain't enough. Daily wage is 90 bucks. Wow. That's actually really accurate. Scary, actually. Scary accurate. What's his daily wage? $80. That's inaccurate. I think cashiers make more than stockers. I'm pretty sure. I like it that they don't go up constantly. Like they don't, you know, stocker 2 and stocker 3 and stocker 4 don't cost more. What do I need? Purchase rack. Required store level 15. What are we at? 12. Okay. What's that? Well, I might as well not even bother to purchase the rack until I reach at least level 15. Dang. This is level 20. Yeah, it's supposed to go cashier, stalker, cashier, stalker. I, I think I addressed that in one of our earlier episodes. But yes, my next goal is stalker. So I'm going to be doing a little bit of offline, off-screen grinding. Um, if you want, I could live stream it, but I need, I, I, I'd have to wait for a day off. I still got four days to go. To actually, God, I can't, I can't even. You'll have to catch me on Call of Duty with the Dub Squad. Because, uh, yeah, I, I got so much to do, so much to do. Anyway, I've already overstayed my welcome. Thank you all so much for watching. If my OBS hasn't been recording this entire time, um, <laughs> I almost said I'm going to swallow that. No, never joke about that. No. Um, yeah, Ezekiel, thank you so much for all your hard work. You're amazing. Uh, here's a raise. Here, step ladder. That's a raise. I didn't have a step ladder. I wanted to get a step ladder. God, end the episode. Just stop it. Just stop. <laughs>